everybody. Thanks for tuning in to this episode. I'm going to be showing you today how to install your new Hero 8 onto the front of your motocross helmet for vlogging, as well as how to hide this mic adapter and where we're going to secure our mic. What, in my opinion, is the best vision for vlogging right here on the front on the uh, chin piece. You're going to need some JB Weld. I like the JB Quick Weld, obviously, because it's quick, it's a little faster. And then some Scotch Bright, some Scotch 3M Dual Lock. I use the Extreme Fastener stuff. I threw links to uh, all the stuff in the description for you guys, so it's easy to find on Amazon. And this is like a double sided Velcro that I'll show you, it's cool. There's not a, there's not like a male or a female side. It just sticks to itself and it's strong. I used it in the past actually to mount GoPros right on the top of my helmet and they never fell off. So we're going to use this to mount the mic inside, but we're going to step by step first here. We're going to start first things first. We're going to put our mounting plate on the front of our helmet here. So I'm going to pop this chin bar out actually. Now if you need, you could probably put a little screwdriver under mine popped out pretty easy because I've popped it out before. Using a GoPro mount without the sticky thing. And my plan is to JB weld it onto here. You could use the sticky one. I personally think since I'm JB welding it, since it's thin, I'm going to try to cover this whole surface first and then put it on. So... Going with a little different approach than what I've seen in past vlogs. Hopefully it works. Hopefully I don't lose my new camera. I guess time will tell. So we're going to mix up some JB Weld here. I'm going to go get a stir stick. Stir it up. Lather the mount for JB Weld. First. Oh, shoot. Don't do what I'm doing. Try and hold it still. And then we're going to hold for a few minutes and then we're going to put some more on. Where to mount this mic adapter? So, my plan is to install it right on this side that I have a little bit of free space. I'm gonna put some double-sided Velcro, stick it on here. I'm gonna cut a little hole in this mesh and seeing as that's right where the GoPro is gonna be sitting. So the GoPro is gonna sorry, sit this flat. GoPro is gonna be sitting roughly here and it needs to plug in on this side. So I'm gonna trim a little hole right in this mesh and feed the cable right out of there. Take a piece of our 3M dual lock and we're just gonna cut it to size and stick it right on the back of there. Right. The cable's gonna come out like that. So the cable needs to come like that. So we're gonna try to mount it inside so that it's got the straightest shot. Hopefully. With the razor blade, so I ended up poking a hole with the razor blade and then using this side cutters to cut this hole in the uh, mesh. It's not the best. I think it should work though. I'm gonna try to maybe put a little tape on here to kind of get it the sharp little edges from poking at the uh, cable, but that's pretty much it. Got a hole cut now, so now we're gonna Mount our cable and test fit the wire through. As you can see, we're just gonna fish this guy. I put a little duct tape. This is gonna get covered up with the new with the mouse with the mouthpiece. It's just drying right now, so don't worry about that duct tape. You're not gonna see that. Just keeping that metal mesh from uh, poking at the wire. Wanted to leave it in there to keep some roost deflection in case I do use this as a motocross helmet ever even though typically it's worn in our stunt shows in the parking lot but as you can see guys we got this fish through we got our double-sided tape and we're just going to kind of want to eyeball 
where it came out actually. Where roughly we're gonna want it. So we're just gonna stick that guy right about there. So I'm gonna install the other piece of the dual lock and simple, simple. So what I'm gonna do to install my mic, I'm actually gonna use this alligator clip and slide it in that slot right there next to my Lexan headset. So let's see if we can't win. Okay, so we got it all mounted up. Cord goes nicely through there into the mic adapter. Got the purple panda mic wired all the way around through the helmet padding. Just kind of untuck that, show you guys. It's all just wires are all just taped up in the edge here. Just taped everything up, hit everything. I mounted that on Velcro so that way I can, whenever I need to take it off, I can just unplug this and pop that off unplug that and we can fish it through and we don't have to leave this cord flopping all the time but overall i'm pretty pleased with the do-it-yourself moto vlog setup here without the uh, media mod case for the gopro i think it's sleeker actually than having that big honking case on the front of your camera but we'll see what that actually looks like when gopro releases it we're going to do this on my helmet for now and then maybe get the media mod case for Sawyer's so that we can do some sort of uh, comparing and contrasting for you guys. But uh, yeah, that's it. Just to give you a little overview again here. Got the silicone case with the GoPro mic media adapter. Purple Panda mic shoved in there all in this motocross helmet that's gonna be the setup guys